Here are some of the mods I've done to the outside of the caravan to stop water from possibly getting inside the lockers. As the water runs off the roof it can't go sideways due to this moulding here, it has to run down the front. When it gets to the stone guards here, the easiest way for it is to go down here and then find its way down and that's where it gets in the locker, similar to the gas locker. It runs off the windows or down this slit that then directs it down here and then through here, through the gap, then down again. To help solve the problem, I've siliconed all round here inside so the water can't get down there, round here, and the awning rail groove, because this part down here is no longer used, water can no longer run down here, it runs to here, and as you can see, it's siliconed up so the water then comes out and runs down here and away as opposed to disappearing down inside the fairing where you've got no idea where it's going. This is also siliconed up so the water can only instead of going down the groove here has to run down here and off the edge. The water used to run down to here and then it would come off, run down along here and then unless it dropped off it could then track under the floor and then could go under and wet. The underside of the floor, these are previous stain marks you can see on the front. As you see the washers are still bright due to my little modification. This is another little mod I've done to create a drip stop so the water can't get onto the underside of the floor. This is a piece of plastic I've acquired that's that shape and it just pushes in like so. The cutouts are for strengthers on the back of the fairing. So any water now runs down the front, hits here, can't go inside, comes to the end and just drops off onto the floor as opposed to possibly going underneath to cause damp on the underside of the floor. Underneath where the fairing is fastened on I've put spaces between the, the plastic bit and the floor so it can act as a, a water trap. As you can see it's nice and dry, no signs of discoloration at all under here. This is old before when I had the problem inside but it's now nice and dry. You can just about see up here the uh, the drip bar I've put in so the water no longer runs down here to wet the floor so the water now drips well away from the floor. <laughs> 